What's up, everybody? It's the movie guy. So, you know what? I was really in the mood for some camp tonight. So, I ended up watching the 1978 classic by Joe Dante's Piranha. Uh, this stars Dick Miller, which you might recognize him from another Joe Dante movie, uh, as Mr. Futterman in Gremlins. This also stars Kevin McCarthy, who plays Dr. Hope, which you might recognize him from Twilight Zone, the movie. Uh, you know what's crazy? This came out in 1978, the same summer as Jaws 2. Steven Spielberg and Universal used, actually filed a junction to not have this come out the same summer as Jaws 2. But Steven Spielberg gave this movie uh, a lot of praise. So Universal, Steven Spielberg dropped the, lo dropped the junction and this came out the same summer as Jaws 2. Uh, this has a 71% from the critics on Rotten Tomatoes and 51% from the fans. I feel like that number should be reversed. I'm really surprised that the critics actually like this movie more than the fans. Uh, it went on to gross $2.9 million on a $700,000 budget. Phil Tibbet, which he did a lot of the creature designs, for star for the Star Wars movies, uh, he did like seventy one to seventy two uh, pir uh, piranha designs, and uh, he actually did four with metal teeth for a lot of the close up shots. I don't know if the lake scene with the kids would pass the day. I don't know because obviously nineteen seventy eight is a lot different time than it is from twenty twenty four. You know what? I'm gonna give this a five point three. It's an okay movie. Uh, I do love my fair share of camp. I'm really kind of excited to see Piranha 2 because I've never seen Piranha 2. I haven't seen the 2010s remake since I saw it in theaters. But anyway, I'm going to give the movie a thumbs up just because it's the late 70s. I love late 70s and 80s uh, horror movie. Uh, it's camp. Yeah, this one was fun to watch.